Now, water worries in Orlando. A concerned News 6 viewer says crews working to clean up tainted groundwater started drilling near her home. Now, she wants to know if it is dangerous. News 6's Eric Sandoval is in the city's Paramore community tonight with what he found out. Eric. This drilling happened right here along Robinson Street in Orlando last week. You can see where crews topped this hole off with cement here. This is happening right outside the Paramore Community Gardens. So why were these crews drilling and what were they looking for? These pictures snapped last week show contractors in the Paramore area with their big equipment drilling holes in the ground. The pictures were taken by Luana Gelzer, who sent them to News 6. I was very concerned because it was the second time I saw drilling in my community. She says she was concerned because the drilling was happening just one block away from here, the former Orlando gasification site. It's here state and federal environmental protection agencies have been working to clean up a big mess. They say for more than 80 years, a facility used to produce gas for cooking leaked chemicals into the soil. Some like Gelzer fear those chemicals are now causing health problems, even though the government says there's no solid connection. As a child care provider for 40 years, we've had children come in here with brain cancer. They survived too. We've had several kids with major, major respiratory issues. Mm -hmm. News 6 contacted the Florida Department of Environmental Protection and they confirmed what these crews were doing was connected to the site cleanup. A spokeswoman said the monitoring wells being installed are to take groundwater samples for analysis of petroleum contaminants of concern. Now, the EPA says the drinking water in this area has not been affected. The people who live in this neighborhood get their drinking water from another source. So they're moving forward with cleaning up the groundwater. We found out this project continues through November. We're in Orlando tonight. Eric Sandoval, News 6.